Hey guys, Jim Boyvin here, and today I'm on this newly generated world as you can see right now. Um, we just started this awesome world, and pretty much it's going to be the start of my new series. This series is going to be pretty much where I do awesome redstone buildings, all that cool building stuff, and I'm going to show you guys in the tutorial. So today I'm going to be showing you uh, advanced slash compact auto refueling charcoal factory. So let's go ahead and make it. So first of all, what you want to do is I'm going to go a little bit faster, unfortunately, guys. I do want to make this design go as quickly as possible. Um, so I'm just making sure I got this right. Um, so boom like this, boom like this, uh, and we did mess it up. So it should look something like this, and then what you want to do is come around here, and then you want to go ahead and place on first just like this, then go and get your redstone comparator like this. Uh, and then you also need a redstone computer, just like follow what I'm doing, guys. So go ahead and set that to four ticks. Then what you want to do is have your machine like this, like that, like that, and then you can go ahead and go um, like that. So pretty much there is pretty much a few ways you can do this. So after when you are done, you can go ahead and just cover this all up if you do want to. Uh, but before you do cover this up, I'm just going to do a little bit of covering. You want to do, do a few things. You want to first grab a stack of wood to start this off. Go ahead and put one wood at the top right here. Just throw that in there. Then get yourself up for dirt. Then go down... Um, oh my god, I'm forgetting this right here. Go and place a hopper facing into this one right here. Go ahead and put four dirt like this. Go ahead on top of here and put the rest of the wood in there. And then it's auto refilling. Then what you gotta do is you gotta cover it all up if you want. You can put a glass there or whatnot. Depending if you want this to be an underground farm design or not. Uh, to be honest, I would like an underground farm design because that's kind of nice. But if you don't want an underground farm design, then it's pretty much without the covering. Uh, and then you pretty much just cover this up. Uh, then when you're done covering up, which I'll be in just a second, you wanna go ahead and do a double chest just like this and then what you can do is you can maybe get rid of that or what you can do is just leave it or what you can then do is just do this just leave it like that and you can be this is the place where you insert wood the only problem is this does however will clog up if you're putting multiple stacks of wood in there so maybe you can go ahead and just put a chest like that if you really want to and then you pretty much collect your coal in here so if you wait a while uh pretty much what you will find is um as you see right down here, there's oak wood coming into this design right down here. Uh, and then pretty much there should only be one in here, um, which is kind of weird. Um, there should be one like that. I guess I put it in the wrong spot. But pretty much, am I doing this right? Yeah, I'm doing it right. Okay. Okay, it's all right. It's good. Okay. I just wanted to make sure it's right. If you guys did do that, I may have put the wood in the wrong spot. Just make sure that there's one wood at the bottom here and all your, sh uh, your wood at the top. And then go ahead and cover that. Sorry if I did, if you guys did make that mistake, which I did. Uh, and then, yeah, you pretty much have to design here just like that. As you can see, this is going to be where you're going to be getting all your coal. Um, but then there's a chest here that when pretty much... We go ahead and pretend that we got a few sacks of charcoal. So say right here this machine filled up, it has full charcoal. The charcoal will then empty into here. And then after when it's full there, you should see the first charcoal begin to come here as you can see. And then yeah, then your charcoal will begin to pile up here. And you can simply just collect it when you need charcoal. And then you put your wood in here. So that is pretty much it guys. As always, if you do like this video, make sure to hit that like button. And if you really like this video, make sure to hit the subscribe button. This has been Jim Levin, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.